The suspect in Boston's marathon bombing lies in hospital in what the governor of Massachusetts describes as a stable but serious condition. Meanwhile, calm has been restored to the streets of Watertown, the Boston suburb where 19-year-old Zohar Saniev was captured on Friday night. We felt really safe, actually, um, the whole time. The only time I got a little nervous was when the um, automatic fire happened, when they first um, sort of uh, set their perimeter here and I made themselves aware or made themselves known to the suspect. I was scared because you didn't know where this guy was. I just had an unsettling feeling that he wasn't far and um, that's not a fun feeling. More than a hundred police officers converged on the area where they believe Saniev was hiding. He was eventually discovered by a homeowner who'd seen blood on the boat in his backyard and found the wounded suspect hiding inside. Zohar's 26-year-old brother, Tamalan Saniev, was killed during a shootout with police on Thursday night. Not far from where the bombs exploded on Monday, a memorial's been set up for the three people killed and 176 wounded. The suspects also shot and killed a police officer at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology.